guys welcome back to my channel what's up i know what you're thinking it's been so long and it's like i came back at you on some realness okay because i've been experimenting with cbd and if a lot of you don't know what cbd you probably heard of it but don't really know much about it i mean i was like that too um i always find myself watching videos about um medical marijuana per se like not even just people smoking weed like we don't call it weed like i call it medical marijuana because i've been watching a lot of videos talking about that and how all states now legalize cbd which is awesome because a lot of people they want to use that marijuana is their medicine everywhere i go and it's like well if that's the truth you know that like only 29 states legalize medical marijuana so for all 50 states to legalize cbd it's like now everyone has a reason to have a medicine without getting high and me personally i do not do drugs i drink for the most part and that's pretty much it like i don't like smoking ever i don't even like vaping it was like i loved vaping and you guys know that which i am gonna do another vape collection video soon very soon but I really have been experimenting with CBD because a lot of people don't know this about me but I do suffer from anxiety and depression um, I have self-diagnosed myself with that honestly because I have insurance but even just to go visit the doctor is like two hundred dollars and it's just like it's unbelievable how much it costs just to see if something's wrong with you um my job really does stress me out people make fun of me about it but i'm very serious about it which is why i do a lot of research about anxiety and depression and my stress level and that's why you know i really wanted to go to the doctor and get them to diagnose me with anxiety but you know Paying for that and realizing uh, one thing I really do like is Adderall, but that is really addicting. And uh, I've had someone tell me they had hallucin um, hallucinations from doing Adderall. And I was like, okay, this is what we're not going to do. We're not going to hallucinate, okay? So what I picked up from Bilegal Meds is these little babies. Mm okay so this is a cbd oil um pin i wouldn't even say vape it's a pin and this one is watermelon and 100 mg cbd so this is actually a good amount because i tried a different brand i bought it from like this sex shop and it was amazing like i really would go back and get that but i've been deciding to try um, a brand that everyone knows about and it's cloud nine I don't know if you guys can see that but this is cloud nine and I've heard really amazing things about cloud nine so I picked up this little pin this is 200 puffs I don't know I'm I don't know if I'm running out um I just been puffing it to give it a try and then this I had I did try it is a pre-rolled cherry wine CBD flower I do not like this at all this just reminds me of just like some illegal stuff and I don't like it and I, I'm, I'm gonna try it out for you guys today because I want to see if it really helps and works for me today because I've been so stressed lately about work and um and there's just a lot going on in my life right now that I just cannot but I did want to tell you guys some things about CBD just in case if you wanted to try it but you know you want to ask your parents because you know if your parents know that you have anxiety and maybe it's cost too much to go to the doctor this is um this pre-roll was ten dollars it's half a um gram and this was 39 so 40 dollars but it's on the go you can't even see like when you smoke it it's it's better than this like if you smoke this outside people are gonna think you're smoking weed and i don't want people to think that because that really goes hand in hand with my anxiety um, and being paranoid um so some things that CBD actually helps with that is clinically um, proven and I've seen a lot of documentaries about it is epilepsy um, cancer and one thing for me anxiety um, disorder type 1 diabetes acne Alzheimer's disease oh my god like it's amazing how many things that like a lot of people have acne I don't have acne um, but I do have anxiety 
So it was saying it helps with um, general anxiety disorder, panic disorder, social anxiety disorder, and obsessive compulsive disorder. And I'm gonna be making a video about my OCD that I actually do go through every day. And that's why I really wanted to try something like this because honestly, I just wanna, like I've been trying everything and honestly nothing has worked and there's no cure for it. So I don't have anxiety, um, social anxiety. I can go out and talk to people. I do that at work every day, working in retail for three years. Um, that's nothing new to me. I do have, panic disorder because i do panic a lot and i just i don't know it's just me i don't know guys like i just i know what i go through and uh, honestly i don't know if this has been helping i've been using it for a few days now like maybe two or three um i i have anger problems sometimes and i don't know if it helps with that but the one that i tried at the sex shop it actually told you what it helps you with it helps you get energetic happy and honestly that worked so much better for me so i'm gonna be trying to use these over the next few months and probably order some more and come back and tell you guys how i feel about it but you know if you are going to be trying this or want to try this and you want your family to know what you're doing i would suggest you do your research and come at the people correctly and just know what you're talking about. A lot of people, they make fun of me because I choose not to smoke weed. I promise you, people have tried to get me to do it. People that I really, I'm really close to have tried to get me to just smoke weed with them. And I tell them that's not something I do. I, I just, I know. I just know. Like, it's illegal, guys. Like, I'm not trying to do anything illegal out here. Like, I really just go to work and come home and sleep and eat. Like, that's it. So... I'm not trying to do that and I know like I've watched videos where it says weed has actually made people with anxiety disorders you know go off the wall because it actually goes hand in hand some people say it chills them out but when you have a legit anxiety disorder it actually triggers something in your mind so then you have a more anxiety than you already did so and being around I've been around people who smoke like don't get me wrong, I'm pretty sure I smell like weed once in a while because first of all, people be smoking weed at the club and then second of all, I have friends who smoke and I don't judge them, I just say don't pass me the blunt, like that's all. So, um, and they, you know, they're understand, um, understanding now that I talk about my anxiety a little bit more, I couldn't understand what was going on with me, but now that I know, they don't talk to me about it, they don't ask me about it. I just, I've been informing people about CBD because a lot of people don't know about it. And I have a lot of pothead friends who said they want to try CBD. So, and they just don't know anything about it. So I'm happy that I'm coming up here and just letting people know, hey, this is what it helps. So yeah, fighting cancer. I've seen videos. People, do your research about CBD before you come at the people who are doing it. Because a lot of people are like, why don't you just want to get high? It's not even about getting high. A lot of people who smoke weed, they like, like the feeling that the weed gives them. So there's THC and there's CBD those compounds are totally different one is psychoactive and that's THC and this one is just like helps your body I, even BuzzFeed there's a video for BuzzFeed um a lady has TN I don't know what that is it's like a nerve something a, your nerves are damaged so it just it's horrible I watched her video and I did not know she had that so I will link the BuzzFeed video because that was actually informing about medical marijuana where she actually smokes THC and um, CBD and she sees which one she likes because there's ones like, you know, lotion. You don't have to always smoke it, people. So, yeah, I'm going to le leave the link of the um, BuzzFeed video and the link of this website that I've been going on looking up research because, honestly, it's giving me a lot more insight on how CBD helps other people and not just me with anxiety. And it tells you the difference between CBD and THC just in case you don't know what it is and it says how CBD works, the benefits, um, the natural pain relief. A lot of people um, say it helps them when they're on their periods. I don't like taking pills. I, I stop taking pills. I take Midol, but I, I honestly rather go through the pain than take pills. So it has the side effects. Um, but people say there's not that many side effects. Risk, um, there's still a lack of available long-term safety data, um, side effects of all this other stuff, and side effects of other use of CBD. Like, this website actually had a lot of information that I've been sending a lot of friends who've been asking me why I've been using CBD. So, 
I'm gonna leave this link to this website down below just so you guys can if I didn't go over something or if you want me to do a part two of this video I will but before I go I'm gonna just smoke a little something something I'm gonna do these two um this one you can take on a go but this one I'm gonna switch areas I'm in the kitchen and the living room area and I respect my father so much so I will not be smoking in his environment so I'm gonna move somewhere where I can show you guys how these two things work okay all right see you in a second <sighs> sorry guys I'm in my closet this lighting is actually really bomb. I'm actually shook. Okay. Okay. So, let me get my things. So, this one, I could really stay out there to show you, but I didn't want to. Um, ooh. This lighting. I'm sorry. Um, so, this is the um, 100MG CBD pen. So, this one is not like a vape. You don't have to... And you're not going to get a huge cloud. A lot of people think that this is like... If you've seen a lot of people have something like this when they um, smoke oil, like THC oil, it's just like this. But there's a little bit different, I've noticed. But um, this, you're going to... There's a little light at the bottom, so you're going to see... You're not going to be able to tell because it's like shining against the light outside. But it, you'll see when you smoke it that the light's going to come on. And it goes like this. I like to inhale and ex inhale through my mouth and exhale out my nose because that's what I know is getting all into my system. That's what you're supposed to do when it's supposed to benefit you. I wouldn't do that if you're smoking weed because um, it burns. This does not burn. This is just like a regular vape, honestly. Like, you can't even feel it because it's so, you know, light. It's like a light feeling. You could do this, like, at a restaurant if you feel like you're, you know, feeling some type of way or before you go into work. Just... I'm sorry if you can hear my guinea pig. I really need to do this because this is going on the fourth day of me closing up my job when there's three managers. And I'm telling you, it has me hot. Um, I've been angry. I've been distressed. And I get stressed easily, as they all know. But this does not have a smell to it. So you could honestly do it anywhere, like in the movie theater you know at the club if you like i get anxiety at the club too when there's a lot of people like dancing next to me but someone was like oh so you're gonna let um your anxiety stop you from living life obviously not but me i have been watching a lot of videos about true crime and serial killers and cases that have not been solved and kids getting kidnapped and sex trafficking so i think my anxiety have has gone up a little bit more lately because i'm like anxious about going out to the world i like i said i used to walk to the gym when I went and if it's not daytime then I won't go and if I don't have my um, taser I won't go and I've been thinking about taking um, shooting classes or whatever because I just I need protection and this is my only protection so like it helps when I'm like walking like today so Yeah, simple. That's that. And now, oh, this came in something like this. But this is, I like pre-rolls. I like how they look. Oh, oh, I'm not even going to lie to you. I don't like the smell. Um, Honestly, from my understanding, it smells just like weed. Yep, it smells just like weed. Yep, that's how, oh, wow. Th this, it, I already smoked it. Um, Let me show you up close how it looks real quick. This is I've been I've been trying it just before I filmed just so I have more information on what I'm telling you guys, but this is how it looks. Um it's a joint, like it's not tobacco, thank God. Cause I heard that's really bad for your health. So yeah, my little green lighter. And we're gonna try it. I'm gonna try it for you, I'm gonna tell you. Ugh. I don't smoke this every day because I like using my pen. I only got this for this video because I wanted to let you guys know exactly how it was. So, <laughs> okay.
I don't know how I feel about it. My alarm for work. Alright, stop. I heard it's supposed to help you faster. But I just don't like the taste of smoke. My, my closet's gonna smell like weed, but it's not weed, it's CBD. Oh, I should've did this outside. I'm not even gonna smoke a lot of it. So I will say that is the downfall of this, cause this does smell like weed, so if you are going to smoke your pre-roll, please do it outside. My dad's probably going to freaking hate me for doing it in my room. Oh, oh God. I'm going to have to, like, put my oil burner in here. It smells so bad. I do not like the smell of something burning like that. Oh. I really don't. That's why this one, I know, is going to be my best friend. Because that... Honestly, I do not like, I do not like the smell of that because it is hemp. It's like almost the same compound as marijuana, but it does not have the THC in it. So it's going to smell just like marijuana. That's like the only thing that I really do hate about the pre-roll that I did not know. I Maybe that's just on me, you know, being ignorant. I just did not know how, oh, what am, how is it going to be smoked, you know? Like, it looks just like weed in the, um... The paper smells like weed because I, I know this smell because this is what I smell when I go to Ibiza like and now it's in my mouth and I don't know ah you know I would smoke it if I'm outside but then that will make me anxious because it smells like marijuana and it looks like a road joint oh it's like pre rolls what is it what's the point What's the point of pre-rolls? I feel like that's going to make my anxiety worse. I don't know. But if you guys want to get your hands on a pre-roll or one of these or just the syrup that you can put in your drink, um, that you could take a shot of, um, the, what is it? The vape juice. I will leave the link of that website by LegalMeds.com. Legal. Um, all of this stuff that I tried out today is legal. Um, I hope I informed some of you guys. I hope you took this and you roll with it. But I'm gonna go because I have to finish getting ready for work. Because I have on, I can't even lift my foot. I have on my slides. <laughs> and I'm probably not gonna wear these jeans because they don't match my outfit. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you. Um, let me know if you learned something about this, um, in this video. Or if you want me to do a part two of how I've been feeling while trying Cloud 9's brand. I've used a different one. If you want me to use a different brand that you have heard of, let me know. But, because I just started using this and I feel like I'm... 100 and um, 110 percent down for cbd um i love this true con true crime um podcast called mile higher so they actually have a discount code i think 20 percent that i actually did not use but if you want a discuento on some cbd from bylegalmeds.com please use the discount code mile higher you will save yourself 20 percent and hopefully one day i will do more videos and then i'll have my own discount code for you guys so you guys can support me but since i support them and i love true crime if you love true crime please go check out the mile higher podcast thank you okay i'm gonna go now like i said i gotta get ready for work and i have work at three and it's 120 and i gotta go get food Ah, I got so much to do. Okay, love you guys. <laughs> Bye.